Like and subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon to get new video updates. Pokemon VGC North America International Championships Roundtable 2023 Preview The Pokemon VGC North America International Championships 2023 comes at a pivotal time in the 2023 Championship Series season, as the final major event before the world's players are extra motivated to do their best to secure invites and travel rewards. Da, with this being the biggest event of the year, there's also plenty of bragging rights for trainers who can keep up in this massive field. Players have had time to refine strategies that take advantage of the new terrestrialization mechanic and the ruinous Pokémon from the Pokémon Scarlet and Pokémon Violet so fans can expect polished gamma play at a high level. Weavee brought together a trio of top players Aaron Trailer, Aaron Jang, and Marcus Statter, for a roundtable discussion on what to expect in Columbus. They LL discuss trends in team strategy, top trainers to watch, and what they LL be paying attention to as games begin. Remember, you can catch three full days of Pokemon VGC action from June 30th through June 30th on Twitch.tv Pokemon on July 2nd. We LL find out who is going to take home the next North America International Champion title. Chris Shepard. Thanks again for attending another roundtable. I know I am learning a lot from them, so I hope the fans will too. Let us begin. First, what is at stake for NAIC? What are people playing for Aaron Trailer? I think there are three main groups of people to look out for at NAIC. The people who are playing for the glory of the title, the people who need a few championship points to bolster themselves to secure their invitation to the world championship on day one, and the few people who compete in the day two race. Zhang, yes, could it be the biggest VGC tournament ever? It would have to beat the Orlando Regionals, which had 782 players in the Masters division. Statter, it will be interesting for North America to see who can make the top 8 for the world's day 2 invite. So many great players and great performances throughout the season, but in the end only, 